What's up guys, we are finally back once again. We're going to be looking at Mass Effect 2 Remastered Legendary Edition now. If you guys already know, I've already been playing the trilogy, obviously. But I wanted to go ahead and give a full Mass Effect, not only review, but also just, just review the game, the franchise. Now I gave a review of the first one, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Now again, if you played the game, you really should already know what the story entails. Uh, as well as also what you can do, who you go up against, everything. Now, overall, I love the second one. I think the second one is my favorite of the franchise. Now, again, if you don't know exactly what's happened, this game is set two years after the events of the first game. Your ship crashes, you get uh, resurrected by Cerberus, which is a human uh, organization that wants to hire you or use you to go after a alien race known as the Re as the collectors that were once the Prometheans that were captured by the Reapers that were turned into uh, the collectors to gather humans from human colonies out on the outskirts to create a human Reaper, which you later find out through the Omega Four Relay, which you have to go through to find it on their home base and you start recruiting your former allies from the first game as well as new allies and then they carry on to the third game. Now, again, that's just a quick summary. Uh, I really enjoyed playing this one. Again, I was so used to playing it on Xbox 360, so I played that one nonstop. Now, this one, I actually had more to do. I never really did the, any of the DLC, so I was able to do the Kasumi one this time. I was able to do Zade. I was able to do uh, a few others, and I actually was able to save everybody this time. Not every time was I able to save everybody. Uh, normally, the ones I normally romance in two is either uh, Miranda or Tally. This time, I chose Miranda. Now, also, I, I did Soldier as well as uh, no one on my team was did die. I had everybody on my team. Only one that was not loyal was Jack. Uh, she was the only one that I was not able to get loyal and was able to destroy the collector base. I was able to save the fight with, between Tally and Legion. I was able to make sure Tally was not excluded from her uh, from her race, <clears throat> as well as was able to save Miranda's sister. Uh, Garrus killed uh, Sedonis, as well as was able to handle research. So there's a lot that I normally do in the games that I did in this one. I also did a lot more side missions so that way I could have more Paragon and Renegade uh, options when I do uh, different conversation choices. So again, not that different from the original game. Now again, you could tell this was a little heightened, uh, a little bit more crisp than the last, uh, the original one. Cause again, the original one came out so long ago and I'm again, I'm very happy I was able to play this one when I did because again, Mass Effect 2, is what really drove me into this series again i cannot tell you i mean i remember the first time i played this game guys i had no idea what was going on no idea and this game's now 11 years old so again it was up for a remaster I, I, again there was a couple times where again it's got to be priced more patches again i don't think it's bioware's fault i don't think it is um ea's fault or anybody of that nature i just think it needs a few patches just to help it out here and there again i love this series i love the characters now again what was my favorite uh character in this one i like grunt obviously i like garris i like uh, uh samara i love tally i like miranda i like jack to a certain degree depending on you know my mood and then I, again jacob all these different characters that you really grow attached to but again i may i was really liking how you were able to get a full team in this one uh it did come with all the dlcs as well um you were able to get more of your weapons more of your clothes like you could wear like a leather jacket and jeans on a ship or you could you know be more of a politician or a renegade or your normal military outfit so a lot of the outfits that you'd get on top of the ship as well as more customization that you would get in like three you got into this round so i was happy about that now again have not started playing three yet i may start playing that later on uh by day this video this is on sunday so i'm probably going to be going and playing either tonight or at some point this week and then i'll give you guys a full review when i'm able 
to uh, review the game as well as be able to give you guys my thoughts on how they changed the third one if they did. But either way, I really enjoy playing the second one again. That's what really drove me into the franchise. The first one, again, was not my favorite, even though it is the first of the franchise. But the second one, I just felt like it was more diverse. You could do more. Uh, it gave more depth to the story, better villains, better characters, better uh, length of where you could go to different planets, as well as be able to explore planets, be able to uh, be more outgoing. You didn't, you didn't have so many rules like you did in the first one. I think that's what really helped. And I think that's why I like the third one, because they kind of put both in the third one. But I think I just like the second one more, because you seem more like a renegade in the second than you do in the first and third. That's just my personal opinion. But overall, loved it. Uh, can't wait to play Mass Effect 3 again. Like I said, I have the original uh, 3 on Xbox 360, but I will keep them as well as also the remaster just because, you know, my love for Mass Effect. But let me know what you guys thought about this down in the comments down below. Are you guys fans of the original Mass Effect? Do you guys like the remastered? What do you prefer? I mean, again, there's a lot of issues, I think, with the cutscenes, you know, showing again with Miranda's butt and other uh, scenes that apparently were too, um, <clears throat> too exclusive or expect or expectic you know uh with you know certain body parts that was being shown which I, I found completely uh idiotic and very stupid to say and do for oh wow you know women found this you know offensive or or somebody found this offensive it's like okay most uh, when did this apparently get offensive you know if it was offensive back then which it wasn't then all of a sudden now it is it just it, to, to me it's silly and stupid so again most of these ones that want to comment and say something about video games don't know jack about video games so let me know what you guys thought again once again about the uh mass effect 2 remastered down in the comments down below if you guys have new channels to subscribe leave a big fat like on the video if you guys enjoyed if you guys are always new click the notification bell so you guys are notified every time i upload what was your thoughts about mass effect 2 what do you normally do on mass effect 2 was your favorite character uh who would you able to survive have everybody survive let me know what your thoughts were about this and i'll see you guys on the next one